these two male Mustangs aren't horsing around. It's that time of year. <laughs> Breeding season. Breeding season. They're locked in a battle over the females of the herd. <laughs> We met Gus War of the Bureau of Land Management in Utah. He told us the rapid reproduction of wild horses is creating a crisis. We're estimating there's 88,000 wild horses in America right now. And how many can the land sustain? 27,000. Galloping at up to 40 miles per hour in the mountains and plains of Utah, these Mustangs symbolize freedom. Freedom has its consequences if they're not managed. Those consequences can be overgrazed land and starving horses. That's why BLM rounds up thousands of horses each year. But the Humane Society and Wild Horse Campaign told CBS News the roundups can be dangerous, leaving some horses injured or dead. No more or they might be adopted and illegally sold for slaughter. War says BLM spends $50 million of its $80 million budget on off-range holding costs for the Mustangs they gather. We're almost approaching $2,000 to hold a horse for one year. So BLM did some simple math. Rather than pay $2,000 to care for a Mustang for one year, they'll pay $1,000 to someone willing to adopt and care for a Mustang over its lifetime. Do you worry about people who say, hey, wait a second, I'm going to go get one of those Mustangs, take a thousand bucks and take it to a slaughterhouse? You know, or we if, if abuse you, it, you have to you have to say you've got to be concerned about that. So if an adopted horse after a year is abused and you hear about it, mm -hmm. you can't take it back. So if a horse is adopted and then it's titled and we hear about us having an abuse case, we immediately reach out to the local humane group. We visited an adoption in Livingston, Texas. A thousand dollars for a horse. What a good incentive. Yes. Where Rebecca Hirschman brought her 11-year-old granddaughter, Abby. You know, Mustangs don't let many people pet them. This one's a special horse. To qualify, adopters must have enough space for a horse and no history of animal abuse. Is anybody else interested in the Gillings and Pen 6? No, Those approved get, well, a completely wild horse and $500 up front. The other 500 comes one year later. It's beneficial, but it's not why we're here. Mm -hmm. I can see why they're doing it because it gives more people to take a chance on a wild horse. Yeah. Deborah Cash and Michael Gales are taking home their very first Mustang. What are you looking for? I look at their eyes, see if they make contact with you. Uh -huh. Rebecca plans to spend her $1,000 payment on a trainer and horse supplies. Let me get you your package together. Okay. Yes. Our husbands can't get upset with us because we're actually bringing home money. <laughs> but when you see this kind of human horse connection, the horse picks you. Good match for her. The horse picks you. It doesn't really seem the money matters at all. I just think it's about finding them a home. I just feel like I'm helping. You know.